All right, well, today we're going to take a look at a custom modal form and how uh, you can set it so after you complete it, it will refresh uh, regions on a different page. Uh, let me just show you a little bit about what this looks like uh, and what was going on in my application. So here I have a custom form. And if I wanted to go in, for example, and edit a pitch, change the speed maybe from 30 to 26 and hit apply, the change was actually taking place in the database, but it wasn't updating uh, on either my pitch chart or my report uh, on modal close. Or if I refresh the page, you'll see that uh, both both updated. So to, to make this work, what you do is go over here to dynamic actions, you go into dialog closed, create a new dynamic action. So and we're going to set it, uh, we're actually going to map it to a region and we're going to select, in this case, we're going to select the region right here called recent pitches, uh, where the modal pops up from. So we'll select recent pitches and then we're going to build uh, our true case. So on refresh, we're going to refresh a region. Uh, we're going to first start with recent pitches. Uh, then I will duplicate this. And I'll also want to update the region of the chart, which is speed pitch. Click Save. Go back. Let's reload our page. So now if I wanted to change this from 26 to say 39, you can see both dynamically change.